is 2 a.m. on the East Coast. I want to remind everybody that we have the PCGS Mint State 70 Premier Silver Eagle mm -hmm. still to come. Mike kind of held it back for me at the start <laughs> of the show, and, and I didn't know. I was, like, all excited about this, and then we get live on air, and Mike says, oh, yeah, this is the lowest price <laughs> we have ever offered. So stay tuned for that. That is still to come and already very popular. And then just another little sneak peek. This is brand new as well. Of course, not a brand new coin over 1,600 years old, the Constantine. Newish. Newish <laughs> to us. It's been a long time since we've seen that. So just kind of something to whet your appetite and stay up late with us and have some fun with coins. This is a true piece of history that you that's tangible, it's collectible, it's rare, heirloom quality. These are coins that are authenticated that you are going to pass down from generation to generation. And that's why for what, Mike, over how many decades now here at HSN? Two. Two that we have been presenting and offering some of the world's finest coins, whether it's in America or around the globe. Well, I've been here for almost two decades. Two decades. HSN's been selling coins for over a quarter century. Right. So, so um, we're going to move first item up. <laughs> <laughs> this is so much fun. Did Mike put this in here for me? This is all you. Uh, this is all me? This no, no, is no. So... The, coin, the coin part of it's actually very cool. It is very cool. This is our 2019 Barbie 60th anniversary. It is a colorized silver coin. It's $129.95. It is getting perfect five-star reviews already. The big thing that we should know is obviously we're celebrating Barbie, her 60th anniversary. Every girl remembers her first Barbie. We remember playing with them, dressing them up. What an icon in the world of collectability. But then we talk about that limited edition. We talk about the special packaging. Mike, is that a compact? Yeah. That, that is the a, cutest thing isn't ever. Isn't that great? So there's Barbie. Okay. Check that out. Does it light up? Of course it lights up. And it has jewels around yes. the coin. Diamantes, they call I them. I so need this coin. Yes, I know you so totally do. Only 5,000, limited appeals edition. appeals to all the girls in us, sure. right? Look at that. And and then that is, like I said, the light up compact that you're going to have I with the official. I love bathing, bathing suit. Right. Well, and let me explain to you. That's very okay. specific reason that they have that bathing suit. When the original Barbie was released 60 years ago, that was what she was wearing. It was that bathing suit. It was that black and white suit that was on the, that is a picture of the actual 60th anniversary Barbie that you have right now. Now that doll in original mint conditions, hundreds of thousands of dollars, I'm sure, uh, uh, that you're going to have. So we have this done in solid silver. It is a silver dollar coin, only 5,000 in the limited edition. We were able to get I think what we we got 500 of the coins. I think we got 10% of the entire edition. If I'm not making, I might have had a. We might have. We're one of the largest distributors of, of these special coins that you have out there. I, I we don't have anywhere near 500 left. I don't believe on this. I tried to get more. So you have the front of it colorized right there. It's a one ounce silver coin with the custom compact that you have right there. Like you said, already has a couple of five star reviews to it. Yes. We just started selling it like two weeks ago. Uh, it was just released. It's a 2019 coin. Isn't that spectacular? Isn't that fun? And then you're going to have, it comes with the box, the certificate of authenticity. It's so retro. All, all of that. Yes, absolutely. I mean, that was kind of the look that they're going for. And so there's the 60th anniversary box that you're going to have there. This makes uh, such uh, a great gift, Mike. Oh, my goodness. I didn't goodness, mean to yeah. interrupt. But yeah. Oh, no, I no, mean, no, no. Absolutely. I think, I think you're 100% correct there. Don't you think? I mean, for $129.95, this is heirloom quality. This is collectability. I mean, think about it. Her. This is the very first Barbie that launched. Right. This was what she was wearing. This right. is how she was styled. I mean, it's just so cool, so collectible, so different. I mean, for those of us that sometimes say, oh, I don't know if coins are for me. And I always said to Mike when I first started working with Mike, <laughs> and I'd say to Mike, Mike, how do I know what to collect? How do I know what I should get? Because I have no idea. I'm just I'm just a beginner in the world of coins. And Mike said, Robin, collect what you like. Right. Collect what kind of calls to you. Mm -hmm. So maybe this <laughs> evening you're thinking, this coin calls to me. Maybe mm -hmm. it's for my granddaughter. Maybe Maybe it's for someone special in my life. The packaging is five star all the way. Yeah. It's super cool. And this is like a, the definition of back in the day. Yes, right, even the <laughs> ponytail. You got the thing, you got the ponytail, you got the lighted compact. I mean, you know, I, 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 it, everything about it. Remember, ounce pure silver, very limited so edition still coin. still collectible within the coin Absolutely, itself. because the coin itself, only 5,000 in the limited edition. Wow, and let's think about that. Like an average, like Silver Eagle, how many do they release? Mike, on a Silver Eagle, like how many would they release? Uh, 35 million. Okay. Psh. 
30, 35 million or 5,000? Or 5,000. Do you get that in the world of... The um, rarest American regular issue Silver Eagle is the 10th anniversary American Silver Eagle. They made 31,125. That coin in perfect condition, the last one we sold here was $29,000. Yikes. Now, am I saying the Barbie coin will be that? Absolutely no. not. I'm all, all I'm implying is that there's only 5,000 of them and it's extremely limited, so get yours why We have them. And that's not even saying we have all 5,000 either. All right, let's move into our 1994 to 1998 green <laughs> box United States Mint proof sets. Now, these are $99.95. These are on price break. The last time we had seen these was back in September. We have them back in stock. They're $30 off. And this is the complete years from 1992 to, or 1994, sorry, to 1998 on three flexible pay, uh, payments. It, and we call them green box proof sets because they're green. They're green. Yeah, yeah. Green box, green background. The United States government, when they started so making... I'm not smart. <laughs> <laughs> when when the United States smart. government started making proof sets in San Francisco in 1968, yeah. they just, they kind of change up the colors, you know, every every so often. So like the ice were the blue. That's right, blue packs. And then we had purple packs. We got right. black packs. We got all those. Well, these are the green box. Now, here's the interesting thing. If you want to look at the rarest United States government issue proof sets from 1955 till today, mm -hmm. it's these five sets right here. Now, understand... These coins, as you see it right here, th these are San Francisco minted proof coins. Not a single solitary one of these coins was ever made, intended, or released into circulation. They are only available here. It's the only way to get it. 1994 San Francisco minted Kennedy half dollar only comes in here. So if you want one and you're a Kennedy half dollar, you got a, a collector, you got to take this, smash it open, and buy that coin because it only comes in that. Now, here's the amazing part of this. I have my nationally advertised catalog. You're getting to buy these, and here's why, what was this, August, the last time we sold these? Uh, September. September, at $129.95. So I've taken $30 off, I got an incredible buy on these. You're about to get an incredible buy. You are literally buying these better than a coin dealer. Let me explain oh. to you what I mean. So you're $19.99 a piece. You're $19.99 a piece, because we've done the price break. Coin by coin, because here's what happens. So you buy these, you're buying the sets in the original government packaging. Yeah, <laughs> Robin, look at this. I, I do the breakout and everything cheat on sheet this. Back here. Yeah, I got my little cheat sheet on the this value. It's a smoking hot deal. Of, it's, an, it's a ridiculous deal. <laughs> right. Okay, so let's say you're a Kennedy half dollar collector and you just want to collect the Kennedy Which half dollars in here. Is. You're going, yeah, so 99 bucks. I mean, what am I going to do? Well, here's the problem just the half dollars in this collection, $21. $38, $19.95, $29.50, and $34.50 for just the Kennedy half dollars. So the Kennedy half dollars by themselves are about $150. The quarters, $8.75, $22, $11.50, $25, $8.75. The pennies, $8.50, $8.75, $8.25, $9.75, $11.50. $8 $8 $8 the dimes, you ready for the dimes? $21.50. $36.90.75, $25, $39, and $21.50. Just for the dimes. Coin by coin, coin by coin, $442.10. I told you it was a smoking hot deal. 400, yeah, that's right. $442.10, coin by coin. At $129.95, it is amazing. At $99.95, it is a 100% must buy. Let me explain something So this to you. is like an opportunistic buy. B big time. B big time. Big time. You because I would much that. rather, literally for me, yes. it's far better for us to break these open and say, okay, let's sell you the five rarest clad Kennedys of the last 75 years. Uh, five rarest clad Kennedys, actually. It's going to be these five coins right here. It's going to be these five coins. These are the rarest Kennedy. And I can sell it, yeah, because th these are the rarest proof sets from basically 1955 to uh, 2018. So those are going to be the five rarest Kennedys. So I take those out, I put them in a nice little uh, uh, box, and I sell them for $99.95. Then I'm going to sell you the five rarest dimes right. for $79.95. And I'm going to sell you the five rarest pennies for $49.95. And we're going to get somewhere close to $442.10 if I break them out and just put a little package around. Or you can buy them like I buy them at $99, $19.99 a set.
So you get to shop like a coin dealer. Well, well, even better, and here's why. If you want the 2019 United States government issue proof set when they put it out, with shipping and handling, that's gonna cost you about 38 bucks. That's the brand new one, that's the wholesale one. Okay. These are about half that price. Okay, these are less than the current year of issue United States government issue proof set. And that's it, the 2019. If you go back and look at the 2018, same thing. Now go back, the 2012 set, it's like 200, $225, because they didn't make many of those. That's like the next rarest Kennedy half dollar. That coin sells for $100 or $125 by itself. So to be able to get these green box proof sets, they only made five of these green box. You get all these. And here's the key to this. People ask me, why are these the rarest? Why are these the rarest? Remember when the state quarters came out, 1999. One of the reasons that the state quarters came out, that the United States government uh, brought those out, is the United States government Basically, I mean, it was boring. Mm -hmm. Every year, a penny, nickel, dime, quarter, and a half dollar came out. That's it. They occasionally now, did. Now, for Mike to say it's boring, that's something. Yeah, well, it wasn't boring to me. <laughs> yeah, I know. But it was boring to most people. <laughs> oh, okay, let's clarify that. But I'm a coin geek. <laughs> so, I mean, you know, I always find it interesting. <laughs> but people are like, oh, yeah, right, okay, proof sale, whatever. whatever. So, I mean, you know, people kind of quit collecting. Then the coin, then in 1999, the year after this, the United States government releases the state quarters and coin collecting explodes. But they can't go back and remake these last five sets that define the end of kind of the, the mediocre coins. Now, what happens with that is they make these to order. So what these end up as is some of the rarest United States proof coins ever made. You get them all at $19.99 a set. When the Kennedys alone, $34.50, $29.38, $40.50, the, the uh, uh, 94, 95, the 96 is only 19. So I can't sell you the Kennedy half dollars alone at 99, 95. Because I'd have to take the sets, I'd have to break them open, I'd have to put them in individual packaging. So right. if you're a Kennedy mm -hmm. half dollar collector, and and, and look at this, oh, isn't sorry. that spectacular? Oh, that's okay. I uh, I had it the other way. I just wanted to show you the mint seal, and you're always going to get the boxes with every single solitary mm -hmm. one of these. Certificate then of authenticity. You're going to have certificate of authenticity goes in there. They're 100% original, as made by the United States Mint. There is the United States Mint seal that you're going to have. Right Right there as well so these are still in the original government packaging and remember they are 100% proof so these are not the coins that were released in the circulation these are San Francisco what does proof mean Mike if someone proof is really not a condition large. it's a method of manufacturing they're made for collectors they're struck multiple times at higher pressures to give you those mirror finishes the s minted coins there are no s minted Kennedy half dollars that were ever released into circulation, zero, none. This is the only way to get uh, these five rarest proof Kennedys. So we are wrapping up 142, 687, 99.95 on price break with that $30 off. So with that being said, we are going to share with us, don't or share with you, don't forget that premier Silver Eagle is still to come. I don't want you to miss out on that, already proving to be very popular. But let's move into our American Innovation three coin set. Now this is an auto ship. We're going to talk about that. This is 2018. You get the Philadelphia, you get the Denver, and you get the San Francisco proof coin. This is celebrating Americans, or our America, American innovation. innovation. Yeah. <laughs> I got, got stuck on that one. Uh, right. Well, because <laughs> if you look at the coins, they call it the America, in, the American innovator. Innovator. Okay. Okay. If you look at that, it says American Innovator, but they call it the Innovation Dollar. Okay. So it is a little confusing. As you can see, the American Innovator. American Innovators is what this is. So now, um, this is the Philadelphia Mint, Denver Mint, and San Francisco Mint in the lens, okay? And, and you get one lens, I'll show you two, because I want to show you the front and the back. So the, the Innovation Dollar, once again, is going to launch in 2019. And they're going to do every single state in the union in the order of statehood and either an inventor, an invention, or an entrepreneur from every single solitary state. They're releasing none of these coins into circulation. That is crucial for you to understand. And so what that means is, is since no coins are going into no coins are going into circulation, what that means is, is they will make very, very few of them. Secondarily, they have done something they have never done before. 
they released an inaugural coin. That's what these are. These, so they did a 2018 coin to kick off the series. They do not release any of these coins individually. Now the 2018 coins are going to be the key to the set. You have to get in on these right now. If we can go right here. So that's the reverse of the coin. That's what the reverse of all the coins are going to look like going forward. Okay, so you get one lens. This is just to show you, you the That's back. right. You get one lens. You're going to get Philadelphia Mint Gem Brilliant Uncirculated, Denver Mint Gem Brilliant Uncirculated, and then Gem Proof. The obverse of this coin, the inaugural coin, is American Innovators, and that is George Washington's signature on the very first patent ever issued by the United States government, which was for potash in July 31st, uh, 1790. It's something he used to make fertilizer. And that was the very first patent ever released. So that's his, and then that is the, uh, the logo of the American Innovation Dollar Series. They made these for two weeks, folks. I can tell you right now, in my professional opinion, this coin right here, already, already, people are paying $20 plus for the proof coin. The United States government is only going to make about 100 to 150,000 of those proof coins, literally making it one of the single rarest proof coins ever made by the United States government at 150,000. That puts it into a rarity spectrum of like, the American reverse proof silver eagles, which are all two or three or four hundred dollar coins. You're $19.95. Now remember, the government is not releasing the P's and the D's. You have to buy rolls or bags. And they won't be in circulation. No, they're not releasing a single solid. So you can't go to the bank, you can't go to the post office. And because they're not releasing them, even the brilliant uncirculated coins are going to bring tremendous premiums in the marketplace today. The biggest reason for that is when you have to buy a roller or a bag. So you have to be $32, $32. And then you have to get this coin. They're not going to be, this coin, not going to be in the proof sets. These are not going to be in the mint sets. <clears throat> I've had three brief airings on this opportunity. Plus, you're going to be able to get the oh, auto ship, yeah. where you get every single one of these at $19.95. Your price can never go up. Your delivery is guaranteed. And Mike, this is already a customer pick on hsn.com. We already have so 2,000 people in the right. auto ship, okay? So this is your way you secure this opportunity to continue to build upon this brand new collection. You have to understand, with the number of coins that are released with our auto ships, we have about 5% of all the existing proof dollars are already been shipped out to HSN customers. So oh, wow. HSN customers currently so you get first dibs. You get first dibs. Right. And, and the way it's looking right now, you might get the only dibs. <laughs> we have gone out and aggressively tried to buy. I've, I've done everything in my power with given the quantity of these made to own about half of all the coins wow. in existence. That's a statement. Yeah, that's, it's, it's a big investment. It's literally right. hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and but hundreds of thousands. you feel like this is I very feel like important. It's, it's might be the most important coin set released by the United States government in my lifetime. Really? I've never heard you say that. Well, I never have. Oh, uh, no. I, I, and the reason is, I think the subject matter is going to be spectacular. Benjamin Franklin's going to be on Pennsylvania. All the American... I mean, American <laughs> um, Americans are innovators. We're, we're entrepreneurs. Right. It's what makes America... The ingenuity the, 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 drives the, us. The, that's right. Yeah. And this is going to celebrate that. And the problem is the United States government has done what they often do. They just didn't make enough coins. So the problem is, is you absolutely positively... Now, we may they may make a few more of the coins in 2019. We don't know. No, I can tell you for a fact that the inaugural coins right here are some of the rarest regular issue coins that the United States government has ever made. Like, for instance, if you look at a Susan B. Anthony dollar from uh, um, 1999 that was never in the proof set, just like this coin, they made 750000 of that coin. Good luck finding that for 50 bucks. This coin is three or four times rarer. I can tell you right now, this is a spectacular opportunity. And Get it in where you can lock the price in, and we still have them. And it's 1995. So maybe right. if you're like new to coins and you're like, okay, I, I think I'm going to go for this. I like this. You're not breaking the bank. No. And you're still getting something that we anticipate to be highly sought after. It's 1995 with oh, free shipping in hand. Right. Like and by the way, when you ship, get your first auto ship, you get a nice box that it comes into. You know, okay. we, have, we have the And we have then the you get box. them four coins a year. Right. Or, th or three. Not no, all at me. the same time. Four coins per year because this is the inaugural coin. Oh, right. So you're getting, they've, they've never done. We've done a lot of coins. You're not used to the inaugural coins because right. they've never 
never, never done, done it done before. Oh, this is cool. fantastic. Four okay, points per so year after that. Customer pick. Definitely take advantage. How would you like to really make customer that? pick already? We just. Yeah, customer we just pick. released it. I know. I, did, I, don't even, cool? I didn't even follow that. Yeah, yeah it's a customer pick. Um, how would you like to make that set nine ninety five? <laughs> <laughs> I love when I can make Mac a uh, mic laugh. That's always I'm, a good thing. <laughs> I got nothing to do with that. <laughs> $9.95. Now, how do you do that? You apply for the HSN credit card upon approval. Take $10 off your very first purchase. So check that out. And that's a great way you can continue to save and get extra flex pays. Lots of great promotions with our HSN credit card. Now, we're going to move into our showstopper. This is brand new. I have been teasing this since the stroke at one, uh, the stroke of 1 a.m., right? Mm -hmm. I literally came out here and I'm like asking, can I get that coin? Can I get the premier label silver eagle coin this is always highly collectible it, it has been made from the u.s mint since eight or 1986 we're looking at the lowest price we have ever offered on our premier label at 79.95 this is your first edition of i think the first edition is at 2500 units so it's a limited first edition we do not have many and it's on to flexible payments of 39.98 I believe you are also getting a wooden box coming included. Yes, you get a wooden box. Uh, okay, normally it's and a here. certificate that actually has a hologram on it that's individually numbered as well. We're looking Ooh, for nice. that as we speak. Now we're calling this one a first edition, Mike. Is what, yeah. is that like a limited edition? Yes, very much so. It's okay. a HSN edition. This the only place we do have a special edition of the PCGS Premier label specifically for HSN. Only twenty five hundred coins. That's it, 2,500 coins. But Mike, this is $79.95. Yeah. Well, it's event priced. Okay. It's event priced. So, and I've never done this. I think last year's was our first release of the Premier Edition. I think it was $99. Right, I I've never done $79. $89 $80 was a stretch, but then we did the event price. We took $10 off. So let me explain to you what happens here. Uh, this is a huge deal. So we sell, uh, you know, our Annex first day of issue was our Today Special. We sold uh, 12,196 right. points. The it's entire edition completely we'll sold out. Right. We sold... Uh, but that uh, was 89, right? That's right. That was... Uh, no, I think it was $79.95. Oh, okay. yeah. Sorry, I forgot. $79.95, yeah. But then we have the PCGS. Now, PCGS, traditionally, okay, and that was $79.95 as well, because it was event price. It was today's special. Here's the, the thing about this, exclusive to us. At no point have you ever been able to buy... A PCGS, because this coin, there's going to be a lot of PCGS Mint State 70 coins out there. Premier is the key. The key to the Premier is absolutely positively, absolutely positively, that with the Premier, it's its own line item in the population report. You're going like, blah, 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 blah. Did you have my glazed over look? <laughs> <laughs> it just went, I was in, like. In coins, how many of something is in a holder is an important thing. Yeah. Each one of the grading companies release what's called a population report. In other words, how many coins they've graded and how many coins are in each grade. Okay. It's an important thing. It's a, it's a factual document. When you look at PCGS, all of their Mint State 70 coins are all in this huge kind of grab bag. And there's 50,000, 75,000, 100,000. The premier edition that you see here is a separate line item in the PCGS population report. That is a huge deal. Additionally, we have the PCGS approved holographic uh, uh, certificate of authenticity that is individually numbered, that is HSN exclusive as well with the Red Oak presentation box. So the PCGS Premier Mint State 70 is exclusive to us 100% here at HSN. It's 100% exclusive to us. It comes with, like I said with certificate hologram on it that is individually numbered it is critical for you to understand the collectability and desirability of this to be able to get it at $79.95 because people sometimes collect by grading company sure so that's why we have NGC flag court exclusive to us Okay, I have PCGS Premier exclusive to me. Like I said, just like NGC Flag Court is exclusive to me. Those are very, very important determinations. So you have the regular PCGS Mint State 70. Perhaps there's, uh, you know, uh, last year they graded, I don't know, 80,000, 90,000, 100,000 of those, which isn't that many really out of 40 million coins. But our edition was 2,500. 
Okay, separate line item that you're going to have, PCGS Premier that is exclusive. So now, one of the reasons that we did this is that we wanted to have an exclusive label, something that is 100% exclusive to us here at HSN, so that we guarantee the lowest price. Like I said, nobody is gonna pay less than, as a matter of fact, once the event's over, if there's anything left in the 2500 limited edition, it's gonna be $89.95. So that's what the issue is. Have and we offered this before? No. Like previous years? Uh, yes, 2018, oh, okay. 2017. Okay. We did premieres, which I believe are sold out. Uh, uh, the 2500 uh, uh, of those, sell out. When we do Annex at $79.95 on the today special price mm -hmm. at $12,000 and this is $2,500 and this is $2,500 and it's PCGS and there's so many PCGS collectors out there. So this is a label. So you go out there and look around for this. You're just not going to find PCGS it's Premier. Only here. That's right. Particularly with the PCGS, the exclusive uh, HSN that you're going to have on that. Like I said, and it is the only way to get an individually numbered PCGS coin because we have numbered the certificate of authenticity that has the uh, 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 that has the hologram on it and the individual numbers as well as, like I said, the Red Oak presentation box that you're going to have uh, with that, which I think I think we probably have that on uh, hsn.com. But the key to this, certified absolutely positively perfect. This is our launch of this particular coin. It is PCGS. It is Premier. I know it doesn't look like any other PCGS label out there. The reasoning behind that, because it's exclusive to us and we're launching it right here, right now. Right. I mean, and I just think on the two flexible payments of $39.98, get this, understanding the fact that it is that first edition, it is a limited edition, first edition of 2500 Once they are gone, that is it. And Mike, you always talk about, you know, PCGS, all the different grading companies, but to have our own exclusive label only here at HSN, if you are a collector of the Silver Eagle, we know year after year after year, the moment the Mint releases that brand new Silver Eagle, we are all jumping to get it. So I hope today this is graded the highest possible grade. It is Mint State 70. And let's talk a little bit about that, Mike, because when we talk about the grading and the importance of why we should get a coin graded, today you're getting the highest possible grade at 70 and you're getting it at $79.95. For all intents and purposes, Mike, this is like another little mini today special. Yeah, there's no doubt. Right? Well, it's an event. <laughs> it's an event. We'll call it an event. And, okay. and since it's an event, let's invent pricing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, why not? Well, we're at it. <laughs> and I like this price, so I'm good with this. Let's call it whatever we want. And Mike, let's talk about grading, because why do I need a coin graded? Why, in a 70 the best, talk if someone's new? Well, it, it, it's very important. First of all, the grading company, there's only four major grading companies that are recognized that uh, you know throughout the industry, period. Anything else is literally not recognized. You've got NGC, PCGS, Annex, and ICG. We have exclusive limited edition labels for each one of the major grading companies here at HSN. For Annex, it is first day of issue. For ICG, it is first day of issue. For uh, NGC, it is flag core. And for PCGS, it is premier. Oh, and amongst the PCGS, and PCGS may well be it's, uh, it may well be the most popular of all of the grading companies that have been around for a very long time. Of all of the PCGS certified, American Silver Eagles Premier will be the rarest, will be the most desirable uh, uh, from a year in, year out basis. We launched the Premier label two years ago, and I've never sold it at $79.95. You said this was the lowest this price? This is the lowest price I've ever done any PCGS Premier Eagle here at, uh, at HSN at $79.95. So very, very important. Like I said, with the, uh, with the certificates, holographic, you've got the PCGS approved hologram on there so that it matches in essence the hologram back here that are individually numbered so you can get literally an individually numbered PCGS uh, Silver Eagle. Now let me talk about Min State 70. In coin collecting as in any collecting the single most important determining factor of value is what? Condition. That's right. The higher the grade, the more it's worth. And in coins, we grade on a 70-point scale. Okay, that's the highest it goes. It's the highest it goes. Min State 70. It is important. It's significant to the value. Let's take a two, year 2000 American Silver Eagle. Mint State 69, I can sell it to you for 59.95, 69.95. 
In Mint State 70, I have to sell you that same Silver Eagle for $400. So condition matters. Condition matters a lot, <laughs> right. okay? Like a lot of things. Uh, like a lot of things, you know. Uh, we just sold the Barbie coin. Mint in box, that all, you know, what I'm saying, 70 yeah. is, I don't know, $100,000. Who knows what the original Barbie's worth? It, it has to be an incredible amount of money. So it matters in terms of silver eagles. The higher the grade, the more it's worth. So we have Mint State 70. So what you now have is a 2019 American silver eagle. The United States government is probably gonna make somewhere upwards of 25 million of those coins. That sounds like a lot. Of which 2,500 will be premier Premier, PCGS, Premier, Mint State 70, perfect. So when you look at that 25 million, so 1% of those 25 million coins would be 250,000. A tenth of a percent would be 25,000. A hundredth of 1% of all the Silver Eagles made by the United States government will qualify for perfect PCGS, Premier HSN edition that you see right here. 100% exclusive to us here, 100% exclusively numbered for us here, and we're going Going to do it at an event price of $79.95. Unfortunately, like I said, we sold 12,000 Annex coins. I sold 4,000 or 5,000 of the NGC flag cores so far. I can never ever sell in the history. Once we get to 25, and it's not just for this event, once we get to 2,500, like the 2017 coins, we did our 2,500. Mm -hmm. That's it. Right. They, we sold those out two years. Right. No, you can never add to the number. And so what happens is, is you've got this closed end limited edition that we've never been able to do and nobody's ever been able to do with PCGS before, mm -hmm. with this Mint State 70, with our premier edition that we've done with this. Like I said, with the special, uh, these are Tampa Evident Holograms. And you want to have them certified because there are so many counterfeit coins that are out there in the, in the uh, marketplace as well. And so what we have, and I guess we do have an auto ship available on this so you can get, uh, uh, is that correct? I, uh, I, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't. Uh, yeah, we might want to take that yeah, down, Yeah, we want to take that down. I, I don't think that's that. an auto ship. I just noticed that, and I go, I don't think so, because no. the 2017 coin, I believe, is sold out. So, <laughs> right. I mean, you know. There's no auto ship to this. <laughs> <laughs> I Good love catch. auto ships. Don't get me don't, wrong. The next, the next item that we have is a spectacular auto yes. ship. Yeah. yeah, so stay uh, tuned so, for Yeah, that. this is just the event price of $79.95. Mike was having know. a panic attack. Yeah. He was thinking, oh, no, I don't have more. Okay, so it's $79.95. This is our lowest price we have offered for the premiere that we do every single year. It's the smallest at $2,500 to be able to get it at home and on two flexible payments of $39.98. We still have much more to come. We do have an auto ship coming up with our Silver, silver Eagles you don't want to miss out on and that Constantine coin that's still to come. We'll be right back. Hey, can I borrow those? Okay. Yeah? I'll see you later. Shop like a VIP with the HSN credit card. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. As an HSN card member, you'll get all kinds of perks like extra flex on jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases all day, every day. Plus VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, and there's no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. Well, now is time to share with you a spectacular auto ship. And this is an auto ship within our coin collector. It's going to be with our Silver Eagle dollar coin. Now this is going, we're gonna start off with the 2005 Mint State 70 Annex Certified, which is exclusive to HSN. Mike, this is one of arguably the most popular silver bullion coins that has ever been out, right? The. 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 And, and actually I've kind of changed change that, yeah. I believe it's the most popularly collected coin. Okay. Not just silver coin, <laughs> because the silver eagle, I mean, they make, you know, 25 to 40 million every single year, and they're and all gone. And they're all sold out, yeah. So we have sold many times, and 253 is an incredibly important number here. We've sold Mint State 69 auto ships here at, I think, $99.95. They go all the way back to 1986. I'm doing something here that nobody else can do. Okay, so we're gonna start with the 2005 
The 2005 Men's State of America, is that it? Or is, that. It, is that, uh, that's not the right one? It's 2005. Here, that's the 2005? 2005. Okay, Let that's the 2005, that thank you. Yeah. There's the 2005. Men's State 70, so we now have a Silver Eagle there that's, what, 14 years old? Right. In perfect condition for $89.95. So that's a special price for that. But here's the key. We are going to give you an opportunity when you purchase this to do an auto ship, and the auto ship I believe is $99.95. Yes. To get every single, every single 21st century American Silver Eagle in Min State 70. People have done Min State 69s, as have we. Right. For $99.95. Wow. Nobody else can do that. And here's why. Look, people can sell you the 2018, 17, 16s for $99.95. In all honesty, that's probably about 10 bucks too high. Okay. But the 2001s, PCGS, NGC, good luck finding that coin for $500, $600, $700. And you get it for $99? $99. $99. Same thing with the 2002s. $99.95 to be That's fair. right. The 2001, 2002, 2003, 2004, those coins are all two, three, four, hundred. But now you're not going to get them all at once. No, no, you get them one per month. One per month. Okay. Now, with your very first a nice way to get auto them. ship, right. yeah, well, not it not all spreads at once. It, out, right. it does, yeah. With your first auto ship, you get the beautiful Red Oak presentation box that'll hold the entire collection. So not only can you get all of the 21st century American Silver Eagles, but you get them in Mint State 70. That's the key. Now, if I took these back to 1986, you know, go back to the 20th, uh, 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 the 20th century, mm -hmm. then we're looking at, uh, these are 21st century, uh, I'd have to add $40,000 to the price. For real? Oh, absolutely. The, 80, <laughs> wow. the 96 alone, I think, is a seven or $8,000 coin wow. at the very least. I mean, you know, the 90, 94s or well, 3 or 4,000. You should always collect 000. them when they come out. Always. Just get the there coin. There you go. Just collect them when they come out. So the key to this. See, I am smart. <laughs> yes, you are. Of course you are. I know, so the key to this is that they're mint state 70. I mean, literally many, many, many people have done this same exact auto ship at $99.95, but in Mint State 69. Remember, I explained to you the difference between Mint State 69 and Mint State 70. 243, 253 is what I had. And that's an important number because I just really can't add to that. Because what happens is, is these older coins, 2001s, 2002s, 2003s, 2004s, they just don't exist in Mint State 70. They simply do not exist in Mint State 70. It's, it, it, it is a huge, huge, huge deal for us to be able to do these at $99. Nobody else on the planet can sell you these coins, let alone this coin at $89.95 for the 2005, which is a huge deal mm -hmm. as well. That is an incredible opportunity. And then with the first auto ship, to get the Red Oak presentation box, which is a $49.95 value mm -hmm. that you're gonna be able to do. So like I said, and then you're gonna be able to put the entire collection, so you get the entire 21st century collection of American Silver Eagles in certified perfect Mint State 70, like I said, a collection that nobody else is going to be able to do to you. You can't do that at NGC or PCGS for anywhere approaching this price, for anywhere approaching right. this price to be able to get every single one of these American Silver Eagles. And since we're doing one per month, it takes a little bit. So you're going to get the 2019 and you'll end that in 2020. That's so amazing. you'll end up with 20 coins. That's and, exactly. and how many now are left, did you say? Okay, so yeah, just so about people are jumping in on these huge, and big definitely time. think about it. When your first coin is going to be eighty nine ninety five, and you have free shipping on that first two thousand and five coin, we very rarely get to see free shipping this evening. We've seen it on a couple items here and there. So take advantage of that. You always have a thirty day money back guarantee when you get on auto ship. That's your your first auto ship will come with the box, and then we'll build upon that. Right? Yes, that's correct. Obviously, you won't get the two thousand and five again because you already you already right. purchased it. That's the first so, one. Right. Exactly. So we'll leave that available but oh I gave a little teaser about this earlier and you know pretty what? Cool. I, it is pretty cool I had a chance to go to Monticello in Virginia to Thomas Jefferson's which was super cool I suggested if you're in Virginia to do that but this is the 1993 Thomas Jefferson coin and currency set it's $129.95 we have this oh and this is on sale which is fantastic I believe we only have 104 of these available it has taken us that's absolutely 
absolutely correct, 104 are available. It has taken us since September, <laughs> I love when my glass, to get this in stock. So just the rarity and how highly sought after this set is, Mike's gonna break it down, but I would not hesitate to jump on this one early. Well, first of all, they only made 167,000 of these. That's okay. an important number. All right. First of all, you've got the special $2 bill, with of course, Thomas Jefferson on it. Yes. As well you would expect. So you've got the great $2 bill. And if you fold this over and do all that, that is the famous John Trumbull painting, the signing of the Declaration of Independence that hangs in the Yale University Library okay. that you're going to have right there. Isn't that absolutely stunning? You open this up, and on this, this is the Thomas Jefferson, sorry, special commemorative silver dollar with a very stylized kind of Romanesque uh, 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 bust of Thomas Jefferson. That is that Romanesque. Isn't that, mm -hmm. isn't that really cool that you're going to have with the reverse of that is spectacular as well. As you said, Monticello right there. Is that absolutely beautiful? Now, all these are cool. The silver dollar, this right here, truly spectacular. Price break, $50 off. The key to all this, though, is just this little nickel right here. Really, just in the nickel. And the reason is, this was released in 1993. Okay. 1993, they didn't kind of do special stuff, okay? And particularly since they used a 1994 nickel in it, okay? Even though it was released in 93, in essence. They, they, they called it a 93 because of this right here, because of uh, what this was. This was a matte finished nickel that only comes in this set. It's the only place to get that coin right there. It is different than every other Jefferson nickel, there you go, that has ever been released. The mintage of that coin, as you can see, in this special matte finish is 167,000. That's an important number. That is the rarest Jefferson nickel ever made by the United States government, and it's not even close, basically. The only thing that comes close is perhaps the reverse proof. This coin by itself commonly, commonly sells for $100 to $129 by itself. You also get the silver dollar. You also get the special $2 bill. You also get the original government packaging as well. So by the time you put that special edition uh, a Jefferson nickel in there, that mm -hmm. only came in the coin and currency set. The United States government has now a tremendous history of coin and currency sets that bring huge premiums in the marketplace. This is really kind of what kicked off the entire thing right here and the fact that they put a special coin in it. The fact that they put this Jefferson nickel in it and it was really one of the first times that they did a special issue coin where they did a special matte finish on it. That is a relatively common thing now, but it was very uncommon when this came out. It was ex it's extraordinarily uncommon when this came out. Now, understand that the Jefferson silver dollar by itself is significantly desirable and amazingly collectible. That's Add neat. in all of the informational things that come with yeah. this as well, which Robin was just reading while we were there. Yeah. The fact that they only made 167,000, and because of the grading of this, very few of the sets remain in the original government packaging, as you see this here, because these certified nickels that you're going to have right there, the certified nickels bring huge money in the marketplace, yet you get it in the original government packaging, a customer pick at $179.95, at $179.95, when we take this to price break at $129.95. I don't know that I've ever done this at price break, I don't recall. I know I've sold a lot of these, as many as I can get my hands on, at $179.95. Now, I don't, uh, I, I, like I said, by the time we do this, since it's the 73 set, I don't know how many that we have of these. I'm assuming this is a pretty we, we limited. We started off with 104 okay. remaining, so that, I'm sure. Oh my goodness, I mean, so I've got maybe 100 of these or so right. to go around. And like I said, here is the, uh, uh, as you can see, this is the Jefferson silver dollar that mm -hmm. comes in that. So that is silver as well. So you do the incredible price break. By the time you look at that, you're getting the matte finished Jefferson nickel there for, uh, uh, for 
for, I mean, you know, by the time you figure that in with the $2 bill, about 40 or 50 bucks, you can't buy that coin for 40 or $50, plus to get it all in the original government packaging, and 100%. And then where's the $2 note? Oh, right. is it? Oh, it's underneath. All right, there you go. There you go. Special two dollar note that you have there as well. So all of that comes included. One twenty nine ninety five. We also have three flexible payments of forty three dollars and thirty two cents. There's no coin shop that you go into and get flex pay. There's Absolutely. no coin shop that you go into and get a thirty day mm -hmm. money back guarantee. This is a true rare piece of history for collectors. You're going to want to definitely have this in your collection. We also want to share with you next, or as a remind. No, wait. This is coming up. Yeah. yeah, this is our piece dollar set. So we are looking at the 1922 to 1925 Mint State 65 Philadelphia Mint Silver Piece Dollar four coin set. Now at $499.95, you get mm -hmm. all four coins. And then we're also going to include the Red Oak Presentation Box. Mike, we haven't seen the Piece Dollars in quite some time. It's been since May. Yeah, and particularly <laughs> these because of the phenomenal high grade. The Peace Dollar is so named because it was originally released in 1921. In 1921, it was released as a commemorative to end, it was for the end of World War I. And if you look at this, when you look at these, it says, uh, you know, in God we trust. And the, the V, uh, uh, the U in trust is actually a V for, for V victory. for victory that right. you see right there. So the Peace Dollars then were released into circulation and available for uh, 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 you know, available for collecting, and they were starting in 1922. They were heavily circulated. The piece dollars? They were dollars? heavily circulated. Yeah. So there are lots of circulated peace dollars. The problem is, is the peace dollar, because it is such a beautiful, I'm gonna flip this over to the reverse, is such a beautiful coin the way that it's struck, high grades in the peace dollars are extraordinarily difficult to get, are extraordinarily difficult to get. And as we look at these right here, these are certified by one of the four major grading companies in Mint State 65, Mint State 65, which is a gem, brilliant, uncirculated. If you go and look in, ge in general in nationally advertised catalogs, Mint State 63, two full grades below this, are gonna be about a $125 coin, which is what we're looking at here. They are Philadelphia, these are Philadelphia minted coins. They are Mint State 65. Okay, they are absolutely stunning, gem brilliant uncirculated for a certified United States government issue coin. Look at those, fully struck, absolutely gorgeous. As you can see right there, the eagle seems to jump off the coin itself. So these are, these represent a, a tiny, eagle, like that's right, these represent a tiny little bit of a percentage of the American silver eagles or uh, the American silver peace dollars. I mean, you know, we see Mint State 65s. You can see Mint State, you'd say Mint State 60, 62, 63s. What you don't see is Mint State 65. Your normal Mint State 65s can run as much as $499 per coin, let alone at $125 per coin. Plus, we're going to do the Red Oak Presentation Box, another, 40, uh, 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 another $49.95 cent value. Now, when you're looking at this, this is really the first four years of issue. Because the 1921, which many people consider it's the first year the Peace Dollar was issued, was really a commemorative piece. It was done in ultra, it was done in a high relief. You couldn't even stack the coins. So we consider that, in essence, uh, uh, you know, a, a first commemorative issue of that. And then the regular issue Peace Dollar started in 1922. So the 1922s and 1923s, relatively common in terms of Min State 60, 62, still very uncommon in Min State 65. But once you get to 1924 and 1925, now, you know, you're starting to get uh, uh, mintages that are significantly, significantly lower. And you're also then starting to get into, like I said, not only significantly lower mintages, but coins that are significantly more difficult to get in certified condition and particularly certified high grade is ultimately what it comes down to. So once again, they are fully struck. They are spectacular examples of the American peace dollar in gem, brilliant, uncirculated condition. Our quantities are phenomenally, phenomenally limited. Like I said, the Red Oak presentation box, 
box, comes with these, uh, like I said, 22, 23, 24, 25, mm -hmm. and, and I'm gonna go ahead since and we have about a minute. They look so beautiful. I mean, if you oh, have a curio cabinet on your coffee table and you wanna put these out, I think for any war vet, I think also they would have appreciation for not only the story behind them, the V for victory. I mean, I just think they're such spectacular, collectible, rare mm -hmm. coins. Four ninety nine ninety five, a limited quantity to go around. Six one eight three four three. But we are going to move in. They literally, Mike, made me wait an hour and fifty minutes before we could present <laughs> these coins. I know, and these are the ones you wanted to do. I, I get that. I know. I was so excited because you know, honestly, when in your lifetime. When in your lifetime do you get to hold a coin that's over 1,600 years old? Mm -hmm. I mean, that just does not happen. This is so rich in history. It is an ancient coin. It is truly seizing a piece of history that you get to hold. It's tangible. It's real. It is so cool. Mike's going to take it away. But this is our Constantine I Roman Empire bronze coin at $99.95 and on three flecks of 3332. So Mike, give us kind of the <laughs> breakdown on this. How well, in the world did you find this coin? Well, I didn't. You didn't? <laughs> An archaeologist actually well, found this coin. Well, that's true. But I mean, how did we procure them for HSN? Well, what happened is they found a hoard of these of these Constantine coins. Okay. And and when the Roman uh, when the Roman army went into battle, they, the the paymaster, I mean, you had to carry the money to pay the soldiers. Sure. Well, just in case they lost, they usually buried the money. And at so. some point, they lost, and the money stayed buried. Okay. And then somebody found them, or there was An a cache of a lord. Yeah, uh, or, a, you know, some lord or something put these away. So if we can get in close on the obverse of the coin, because I, I, I uh, this is an important distinction. And these are real. This is not like... That's the thing. <laughs> they're, they're, they're certified. This is the real... So you have to understand, this coin was made between 307 and 337 AD. AD. These coins are 1,700 years old. These coins are... Set, and they are in, considered to be very fine condition. This is a bronze original Roman coin that is 17 centuries old. It is not reprinted. It is not restruck. It is a 100% original coin. Now, here is the problem. The vast majority of ancient coins that you see out there are fake. Mm. They have been restruck or redone or just they're just pure D counterfeits. That's why when you buy ancient coins, you basically have to buy certified, certified coins or buy from someone you really, really, really trust. So NGC has an ancient department. There's literally these guys, and, and the, one of the single most valuable things of NGC are their collection of coin books for the ancients. Because these old books that were written about these over the course of the last 100, 150 years, uh, I mean, you know, the editions they made 100 or 150 books, and some of these books are 100 years old or so, to be able to identify these coins so that we know basically every die that was used to be able to make one of these coins there's this testing that they go through. So this coin is 100% authentic. Now, who is this guy? <laughs> this is Constantine. This is the first Christian Roman emperor. He is the man that brought Christianity to the Roman Empire in 307, in essence, is, is, is what he did. That is Constantine. That is what Constantinople was named after this guy. Wow. Okay? And this is his coin. And this was contemporaneous to uh, uh, Constantine. It's fascinating. So, so as you can see, Constantine the first, the house of Constantine. This was the dad, if you will. And it's $99.95. I mean, that's amazing. I mean, I can understand $999. I right. can understand $2,000. Right, what I don't dollars. understand is $99.95 is, uh, is exactly what we're going it's to have so right here. It's spectacular opportunity for you. It is so true, Mike. And it's not just that it's authentic. Look at the grade. Right, very fine, very fine. So think about it, he legalized Christianity in in the empire. Right. I mean, this is so fascinating, so cool. Now we want to move into Constantine II. Now this is the son of Constantine the Great. Right. right? So this is his son and this is his coin. Mm -hmm. So this is $99.95. It is also on three flexible payments. We're only here two minutes, Mike, but same thing, over 1,700 years old. Yeah, so now you, he was three 
304 to 337. Now you have 337 to 340, okay? So he was only, he, now issued as Caesar. So in other words, he was a Caesar in the Roman Empire, which is a big, which is a big thing, like the head head guy, okay. just like Constantine the Great. So in he three seventeen, it says he was elevated to Caesar. He was elevated <laughs> to Caesar in three seventeen, while right. his father was still alive. He was okay. just nine months old. Right, exactly. And nine great? months old. I mean, that's a lot of weight on a child. Yeah, father. that's right. <laughs> and, and so this is his coin once again that was stamped, uh, as you see right there. This coin was made for three years, so cool. 337, 337 to 340. So now you have, uh, like I said, the first son that you're going to have, Constantine II, from the house of Constantine in the Roman Empire. All of these came together. So, I mean, you know, this was a, a horde that came uh, a, a little later on than, than anything else. Okay, so with the three flexible payments, this is truly something that will be a conversation piece. If you are a mm -hmm. true coin collector, you're going to want to get this. If you're new, maybe this speaks to you, just the history, the Christianity. Um, this is really something that I hope you get. I think you're going to fall in love with it when you see it. It is a true treasure. It's like going on an archaeological dig, so to say. I mean, it's fascinating. Now, we're going to move into the youngest son of Constantine. Mm -hmm. So this is the youngest. We went from the first son to the youngest. Also Constantine II, okay. but not as Caesar, okay? Right. So he was issued from 337, as you can see, since he was the youngest son, to 361. This particular coin was also released, as you can see right here. Right. So this coin was, was made for 25 years because, uh, you know, as you can see. And it's a, it's a very, and when you look at this, you have to understand, this was, in essence, the portrait gallery of the family. They just yes. put it on money, if you will, it is ultimately what it comes down to. And, and all of these coins, so to collect all four of these coins that we have right here that you all came out of this together. one board. Yeah, they, they really go together. But the fact that they're authentic, the fact that they're, you know, 1,650 years old, 16 centuries old, that they've survived this time. And not only that, that they've survived in this condition. And the way they survive in this condition is when they find them, it looks like a big cannonball. And the outside is all corroded and it's just a mess. And they literally Crack. break it open. And these are the coins that are on the inside. So it's like of a the, protective shell. That's right. All of the other coins corroded around them to protect these coins right here because that is, in essence, rusted and corroded all together uh, 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 to make the coins in the center. And then all the other coins that go on the outside, of course, are in far lesser grade. And then, of course, some of these could well even be uncirculated coins. The coins we have are all very fine uh, uh, condition. So where does very fine fall in? Well, you know, you start with almost good. So you have AG, good, very good, uh, fine, about fine, very fine, extra fine, almost uncirculated, <laughs> uncirculated, brilliant uncirculated. I'm sorry, I asked. Yeah, so about halfway up. <laughs> okay, very good. About halfway up I the scale. I told you he was a true expert. <laughs> I'm telling you. All right. We also have, do we have one more? Yeah, we have one more. Oh, okay. This yes. is our last one. This is This is Constance. Okay, Constance. Tell us about this one, Mike. Uh, 337 to 350. He was just the off son waiting for something for his brothers to have. Something. Did you say the off son? The off son, yes, back in the day. Did I have them so, confused? Maybe, I hope I didn't yeah, have yeah, them the, confused. The I think son. I did yeah, the yeah. youngest son. Sorry about because that, Because what guys. we had, we had Constance, uh, Constantine II. So who was the last released, one we had? Constantine II okay, released second. as his regular coin. The other one was released as Caesar. Gotcha. So it was a Caesar okay. coin versus just his regular coin, and then this is the youngest son coin. Now we've got to That's, clarify. Uh, you know, Sorry there's about a very, that, there, it's very codified how they yes. how they do these uh, uh, these Roman coins and the Roman emperors. But these are all the house of Constantine that you're going to have here. And this way, he was Thank also God an Mike's emperor. Here. That's right, he was also an emperor, em Emperor Constans, as you can see right here. And this coin was issued 337 to 350 as well uh, uh, that you're going to see right there. So you've got this great little compendium of Constantine the Great and his sons and the house of Constantine, which, like I said, legalized Christianity in the Roman Empire. And like I said, you, so you talk about one of the great cities of the ancient world, Constantinople. That's who it was named for. And these Amazing. were his sons. And if you want to check out the entire assortment of coins, please do on hsn.com. There are so many coins that are so limited, so rare that maybe sometimes there's only two available so that never sees airtime. I highly recommend 
hsn.com. Mike, you're going to be back later. 7 p.m. All right, we'll see you at 7 p.m. We're going to have one touch cleaning coming up with Roomba. You don't want to miss it. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900.